God blessings everybody. This is the Gaming Christian with yet again another, you know, let's check, let's play of Metroid Prime Hunters. Yes, for the Nintendo DS. Yes, this is not really a let's play. This is not really a let's check. Yeah, this is really a let's check or a let's play. But this is more like, um, you know, me just checking out somewhere in the beginning of the game, you know, uh, some gameplay elements and stuff like that. Of course, there's a bottom screen in this um, in this, uh, you know, game, I don't really need to show you the bottom screen. Uh, we're gonna show you the upper screen because all the gameplay happens there. Bottom screen only uses me to use my stylus to, uh, play the game. The bumper buttons, or the triggers, the name, the triggers on this uh, handheld. Uh, let me just uh, skip this. Uh, the triggers on my handheld are um, um, for shooting are for shooting and the bottom screen just has some sort of you know um, additional additional options for me to I can you know uh, select the um, rocket and stuff like that but you don't want to hear me talk you just want me to play this game and I've been trying it out uh, yesterday I wanted to um, I wanted to film uh, yesterday as well. On the bottom screen you just uh, choose your mode and since I already have a uh, file I have um, I have this game, I've bought this game a long time ago and I checked it once, you know, to see if it worked uh, I put it in my collection and I didn't get around to play it For now we're just going to apply, we're not really going to jump into the storyline let me see if I can actually... Uh, yeah, I can. Uh, great clips. This is absolutely a great first-person shooter uh, slash action adventure for the Nintendo DS. It really works with the stylus. Works works really good. And um, yeah, this is actually the third time I'm officially playing it because yesterday I played it too just to check how the controls worked. Uh, the screen might... As you can see, I'm in control now. The bottom of the screen makes me do this. It really works well, it really works well. Of course, I can now move left and right with the um, D-pad. I can actually move left and right and in front and back up. With the bumper buttons, you shoot and you can actually, uh, you can actually um, point the direction with the stylus. You can actually point the direction with the stylus where you want to shoot and where you want to walk. It really works. Uh, tapping the screen a few times make you uh, jump. And ah, crap! Ah! Oh crap! Ah crap! Ooh! <laughs> the blocks of uh, the blocks just ah! Oh well, no per no permanent damage has been done. So you can see the graphics looks really nice. I cannot really record this any other way. Actually, I never got around it. Yeah, I barely get around handheld games. That's just a problem with me. You know, I played some of my games in my collection for the handheld, for the Nintendo DS, BSP, and even for the original X, uh, Game Boy and uh, other small handhelds. I also have a Game Gear and a Supervision and, uh, you know, one of those plug and play handhelds where you just buy once. It really doesn't cost all that much anyway, but maybe I'm just going to show you that one day. Or maybe I've, maybe I've already uh, showed you it. Now I must shoot. There you go. I shoot. Let me see. Yeah. Still uh, recording the right way. Okay. There you go. It opened up the. Okay. Now. I don't know. We're just not, we're not really going to. Yes, I. Get away here. Yes, good. This is absolutely uh, the gameplay, uh, this is what the gameplay is actually, you just, uh, it really works. This is one of the better DS games uh, with the, with the, you know, with the um, bottom screen you can actually point and shoot or point and walk like, uh, you really need to shoot with uh, the bumper buttons. Ah crap, who's shooting me? Oh wait, I'm standing in a flower, ah. Okay, that was weird, but I was standing... What is that? Uh, poison Ivy or something? <laughs> yeah, I'm. I've played. I've played. Um, how do you call it again? Metroid Prime, and yeah, this is. This is a sequel, of, or something that looks like it, of Metroid Prime, uh, for the GameCube. You know, 
This is not really a sequel. I know that uh, Metroid Prime... Uh, yes. I was sending in uh, one of those po poison ivy uh, flowers. Here. Ow, ow, crap. Can hear you. Well, I... Uh, um, I have to hold... I can't hold a controller in my two hands, you know, because... Uh, I put it down, you know, so that I can record, but... We're just gonna play a little bit further. Ooh, problems? Let me see. With the other, with the bottom screen, you can also change into a ball. And you can do that with the stylus, or you just do that with the uh, 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 D-pad. For now, we're just gonna use the stylus, because since that is the... The game looks great, plays great, you know. Personally, I really love this game. The only problem I have with this game that it really... Ah, crap. As you can see, I'm really terrible at this game, and even though, technically speaking, I really liked Metroid Prime. Oh crap, what is that? Oh, that, did that open up a path or something? Oh, okay, cool. Uh, I need to change into Magic Ball again. Let me see, we go, we go this way. Uh, now we go this way, I guess. I have no idea. Go this way? This way, maybe? Hmm, kind of lost here. Yeah, Metroid Metroid games are always good games to begin with. Yeah. Uh, sorry to way of recording this, but... I'm not sitting very comfortably either. We're just gonna play for a little bit. I'm not so sure how long, but I think the recording is actually pretty good. Um... Ooh, that, ooh, okay, okay, cool. It's pretty cool. Mm. Yeah, I haven't played this game fully yet. It's in my collection for quite some years now, and uh, right now I'm playing a little bit with impatience. Come on, go up there. Yes. And I have an energy tank found. That's pretty cool. And in the energy cha energy tank. Sorry, my English is very good. Not. Nope. Okay. We're gonna play for a little bit. How long am I recording? Oh, okay. Yes. Go, go, go. Ugh. Ugh. Get up there. Ugh. Where am I now? Did I get back? Yeah, I did get back. Didn't I? Yeah, I did. I did get back. That's so stupid! Okay, you get... Yeah, I... Okay. Um... Hmm. Hmm. No, I can't, uh, Change back. You go down here, and you can go left here, but... You know, I hope I can give you an idea about... Oh, you, okay. Oh, yeah. Ah, come on. No, no, no. Don't wait. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Come on. Go, 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 go. Yes. I had to move the screen a little bit, but not too much, I hope. Uh, let's change back for now. And let's see. Yes, I am supposed to shoot that, yes. Let me see here, okay, we, did we just came from there? What's this? Ooh, I discovered an artifact, awesome. Some rockets, I guess. And now we're gonna be a ball again, because we're gonna play for a little bit longer. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. Ooh. Okay, ah. Yeah, I'm playing in a very awkward... Ooh, I just moved the screen. Very unprofessional of me. Yeah, I just moved the screen a little bit. There you go. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna play a little bit further now. 
I think we're gonna play for over 10 uh, minutes. How do I open this up? Oh yeah, there, there you go, you just... Oh really, ah. Yeah, I played Metroid Prime for the GameCube, and technically speaking, I was really impressed with the game. Everything was just so correct about the game, it really looked great, and... Oh yeah, oh yeah. Ah crap, I'm sending in a plant. Okay, something is hitting me. Oh, that, that thing. Ah. Dang it. Oh well. There go. My energy was depleted, so this is long enough. Uh, as you could see, I'm a terrible gamer. It's too bad I had to... I have to hold the... You know, I have to hold the handheld, like, you know, on the floor, and... I'm playing with my left hand and with my right hand, I can't hold it, but that's not really an excuse. It really just proves what kind of a gamer I am. <laughs> I'm really a bad gamer, but you know, I'm just doing it for fun. And it just wraps up this Let's Check or Let's Play. It's it's really just to show you the beginning of the game or some of the gameplay, not too much special with commentary. I bid everyone a huge God blessing. Thank you so much for watching. Really, if you want to subscribe, you're always welcome to subscribe. You know, it's okay if you don't want to, It's, it's but you're always welcome to watch. God blessings, everybody. This was a gameplay movie of Metroid Prime Hunters for the Nintendo DS. Great, technically speaking, a great game. I think this game is a lot of fun as well, especially for the Nintendo DS. God blessings, everybody. Bye-bye now. See you the next time.